You guys want to hear the dumbest fucking thing in the universe? <laughs> I don't know why she thought it was a good idea to, like, you know, go after a fucking lawyer of all people. <laughs> right? Obviously, we're talking about Illuminati, the person who's being right now dogpiled on Twitter. Um, now, thankfully, in her hypocrisy, you know, we're not we're not talking about children being hurt or anything fucking crazy like that. She's just being quite a goober. So, in case if you're out of the loop of things, I don't know how. It's pretty much I, I, if you follow commentary, you know about this Illuminati stuff. But if you just so happen to not know about it, um, essentially, she went after a legal eagle. If you don't know legal eagle, he's a uh, he's a lawyer. Um, and he runs a little show on YouTube basically explaining court related things, weird, weird, uh, lawyer related things, current court dramas that are going on around the world and stuff like that. Him giving his perspective and it's very educational and stuff like that. And he puts it in a very bite, he puts it in such a bite sized way where like a layman can understand, right? He skips past all like the legalese kind of stuff, right? And he's just like, let me just, I'm, let me explain it like I'm talking to a layman. Pretty great informative content. And I would argue Illuminati also does the same similar kind of content. Very educational, very informative. <laughs> but we'll get into why exactly it is that way. <laughs> um, so she accuses Legal Evil, Legal Eagle of copying his style of videos, right? And it's essentially like these short little documentary kind of style videos. Um, that's essentially what it is. You know, he both of them kind of run it a very similar way, I would say. <laughs> Um, and so she was saying, you're, co you're, you're stealing my style, you're copying me, you're plagiarizing me. Um, and the example she gives is this extremely, I'll put it up, it's this extremely basic, like, preset, you know, like, I could have sworn I've seen that preset in, like, fucking PowerPoint, okay? Bitch, you don't own that style. <laughs> number one and number two she says that they also copy like the highlighter thing which i mean like i don't know if she was born yesterday but that's 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 been around for a while like the, the whole like animated highlighter dragging across like a, a piece of text on the screen yeah uh you didn't invent that what are you talking about <laughs> you know and obviously people are kind of be like you're being stupid why are you saying this um she hasn't necessarily, I don't think she's given a response yet, but people were digging in and it's actually funny. It's funny that she accuses other people of plagiarizing because it turns out she does the same fucking thing. Hugh Fudenberg. Professor Fudenberg has long been controversial. A man named Hugh Fudenberg, a former immunologist who has been long controversial. In 1989, he was caught up in a bizarre lawsuit involving the Food and Drug Administration, which told him he had to stop injecting his autistic child patients with blood products. In 1989, he was caught up in a bizarre lawsuit with the Food and Drug Administration, which told him he had to stop injecting his autistic patients with blood products. Then in 1995, he was suspended from practicing medicine and made to pay a $10,000 fine for his misuse and misprescribing of controlled drugs. Then in 1995, he was suspended from practicing medicine and made to pay a $10,000 fine for his misuse of prescribing controlled drugs. I, I don't know. I, I used to watch a couple of fucking videos every now and then. I never knew that she was like uh, actually like legitimately plagiarizing other people's shit. Um, I didn't know about that. And I'm pretty sure some people were trying to talk about it beforehand, but now that she's created this big fucking drama over over something so stupid, and now it's caused people to pay attention and be like, "Well, let's see, let's see how clean your fucking room is, motherfucker. If you're gonna accuse him of being a dirty fucking pig, let's see how fucking clean your shit is. Apparently, it's fucking not so clean. Apparently, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of just almost word for word verbatim copying from other documentaries." uh that cover a very similar topic to her right so if it ever if you if it ever came off that her videos were very informative yeah it had fucking nothing to do with the way which she was phrasing things and everything to do with the fucking the documentaries coming from actually like intellectual people that she was copying it from right <laughs> 
It's so stupid. Like, all she had to do is literally like JK Rowling, like, all over again, except less egregious, arguably. Um, you know, it's like, all she had to do was just shut the fuck up, and, like, no one would have fucking called her out on it, right? All she had to do is just shut up, just keep it down low, keep it down low, you know, don't throw any shade or anything. Like, if you're being a shady motherfucker, the last thing you need to be doing is throwing shade, because then people are gonna be looking at you. Like, it's that's, like, I don't, this is like a universal concept, this isn't something that's new, right? Don't throw stones in a glass house. How lo how old is that fucking, uh, saying, you know? Like, it just... <laughs> God, it's so, it's so utterly pathetic. That's what I have to call it. That's what's going to be this, the title of this video is Illuminati is utterly pathetic. This is such a pathetic attempt to sort of, you know, uh, give yourself like some big fucking claim to fame when it's like you, you didn't, it, it turns out you didn't even earn it. You didn't even earn it. Like you stole half the fucking work, right? You didn't even fucking earn it. Like, but, but you're sitting over here acting like you're like this big fucking giant. Oh, I got a million subscribers. Hey, you know, that might have been a big fucking number 10 fucking uh, 15 years ago. It don't mean shit nowadays. Okay. You're just, you're just, a, you're just like everyone else. You're just like everyone else. That's, that's all there is to it. Also, sorry for the snuffles. I'm a little bit allergies. Summer. It sucks. But yeah, utterly pathetic display by Illuminati in this whole situation. I, I seriously don't know what in her fucking mind. Because <laughs> it also turns out that Legal Eagle has been doing that highlighter style and that paper rip style for like, you know, longer than her channel's ever been around. <laughs> and she's going to levy that accusation at his fucking feet. He, motherfucker, he's a lawyer. He's been around longer than you. Like all she had to do was just check. Like let's go, let's go past. Let's go look at his videos five years ago. Let's see what Legal Eagles videos were five, were like five years ago. It's literally the same, right? You know, it, it's just it's. I, I don't understand what is it like. What what goes on through these like narcissistic, like dog shit people that just. <laughs> it's like they 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 want to feel like they have this big old dick that could just fucking swing around and do and say whatever the fuck they want without any consequence to it whatsoever and uh out of my mouth if there's any fucking thing that she could take away with this i hope this fucking moment humbles her i hope i <laughs> something tells me it's not gonna humble her okay people like her especially when her whole content is like t channel t channel stuff that whole tea community, it's like a bunch of uppity fucking bitches. I really highly doubt she, this This is going to humble her personally. But, you know, if there's any fucking takeaway from this situation, I hope that she, she, choose, she chooses this moment to be like, I have made a, a what, what was, well, how does the quote go? I have made a lapse of judgment. <laughs> okay. I have made several severe lapses of judgment okay i f i fucked up big time boys okay i'm sorry i won't do it again i'm gonna fix my content i'm gonna make my content more uh you know less uh stealing less stealing of other people's shit and if i'm going to like you you have to realize it's so unbelievably hard to plagiarize people you have to be the most laziest fucking most stupidest person ever to plagiarize someone if you don't want to do the work you could always just say you could always just use a direct quote that's all you have to do dude writing essays in college like i have never been marked off for plagiarism because whenever i felt too fucking lazy to put the things into my own words i just copy paste boom and put it at a quote and then cite the quote like <laughs> like it's that easy it's that easy and, and she can't even be fucked to do that right i don't know man but big big takeaway from this uh yeah illuminati don't throw stones in a glass house i don't know what the fuck you're doing i don't know why you, i don't know what made you think that was a smart intelligent fucking decision but uh, i hope you get humbled you fucking stupid bitch okay uh that's it guys peace out brother oh yeah like and subscribe right short video so do do that like and subscribe and shit next video i am still working on like the drunkenly asking people in vr chat about aliens um except i'm only a weekend drinking person and when i was drinking last week uh i got super drunk 
and I forgot to ask people <laughs> the question. I only asked like two. I asked, I think, hair in my mouth. Uh, I asked three people that fucking question. One of them gave me a full answer. The other two just, the other guy wasn't taking it seriously at all. And the other person was like, we like completely diverted to talking about a completely fucking different thing. But yeah, look forward to that. If that sounds interesting, do the shit, right? Do like and subscribe and stuff, man, dog, person.